So, four months ago, I released a video called My Dog Decides How Long to Ban Minecraft Hackers. And that video got, uh... <laughs> So today, as soon as I'm looking after my parents' house for the weekend, I've decided to do My Other Dog Decides How Long to Ban Minecraft Hackers. <laughs> so this is Kong. He's 10 years old. I called him Kong literally years before Logan Paul called his dog Kong. So don't start with, Oh, you copied the name of Logan Paul's dog. No, I didn't. Logan Paul copied me. Sorry, I just needed to get that off my chest. Anyway, today we are on my server, play.skykit.net, along with 500 other players. Oh, look at all those juicy diamond ranks. And every time we catch a hacker, Kong is going to be deciding how long to ban them. Here's how. So this is going to work very similar to how it worked last time. We've got three mugs. We've got the classic Jack Sucks at Life 2017 mug, the new Jack Sucks at Life 2018 mug, and then just a, a random other mug, because we, we've only got two to mug merches. <laughs> and every time we find a hacker, we're gonna place a treat on top of each one, and each mug will represent a different length of time. So for example, actually no, for the first one we'll do seven days, 30 days, perm ban. And if Kong eats this treat first, that'll be a 30 day ban. If he eats this one, it'll be seven day ban. This one, it'll be a perm ban. So it's just like that, completely random. So we're just using little treats because uh, Kong's already putting on a bit too much weight. Good boy. <laughs> So that's the plan, let's get on with it. And we've got one, you can see that Smiggle is currently killoring against a helper, which is never a good idea, what are you playing at? Although he's still not actually managing to kill him, even though he's like, even though he's literally using kill aura. Oh, in fact, the, the helper actually killed him. No skill required, nice. Oh, and he logged out, he just, <laughs> he literally rage quit. How embarrassing for him, and the whole thing was caught on camera as well. <laughs> Normally, it would be a bit of an issue for hacker trolling when a, when a hacker logs out, but today, Kong's handling the content for me, so let's go see how long we're gonna ban him. Alright, so like we said, we were gonna do 7 days, 30 days, and perm ban. So the treats are all lined up. Kong is just out of frame. I'm assuming from there he'll probably just go for the nearest one. So let's move him slightly. He is so confused right now. Anyway, I'll put him there. Go on then, Kong. Oh. <laughs> there it is. That's a seven day ban. But there we are. That is seven days for the first one. Back to you. Me. <laughs> a bloody seven day ban. A little shorter than I'd like, Kong. I'm not gonna lie. But we'll go with it. What you say goes. So we'll get no skill required to ban them for seven days. Now let's go find the next hacker. Oh, this is an unusual one. <laughs> Charlie the Fox is currently stood AFK on top of water. He's He's got Jesus hacks. Uh, let's check F map. Right, there's a faction here, so he might just be flying in his claimed land. So the only way we can test this is by doing this. No, he's just flying. Oh, that was a close one. <laughs> we'll triple check that he is in this faction. Yeah, he is. <laughs> so on our server, everyone can fly in their own claimed land. So he just happened to look like he was using Jesus hacks, but he was actually just AFK while flying. <laughs> Let's move on. We need to find a second hacker. Back on KidBVP now, Foxes69 is bringing up quite a few anti-cheat notifications. You can see there's one there. The, um, the anti-cheat reckons he's kill Oren. So let's just watch if that is correct. Yeah, pretty sure. I need to just get a little bit yeah lots of head spin there he's all yeah <laughs> really bad kill all right he's doing a lot of hitting at the ground but you can see what is he doing there you need to get a better client mate i think he might actually be afk at the moment should we stand next to him and unvanish for a second just gonna do this hello hello there good to see you <laughs> Yeah, that is a really, really awful kill aura that he's got. Let's give him a little bit of a murder. Actually, I'm gonna give him a few murders, you know? Why not? <laughs> Alright, let's go give Kong some treats. Okay, kill aura scumbag time. Should we do the same durations once again? One week, one month, perm ban. I'm gonna also swap the mugs around slightly. Probably won't make much of a difference. Kong's approaching from this side rather than this side now, so he potentially might go for the perm ban because it's closest. Who knows? Go on then, Kong. They're over there. Oh, middle one, good boy. So that is 30 days for the Killora guy. <laughs> 30 days for that kill aura scumbag. Thank you very much, Kong. There we are. Juice to Grams just banned him. Thanks, Juice. This is going well. Two bands down. About three treats consumed. Let's keep rolling. All right. People are suspecting that Neon Fat Cat is using auto soup. So I've got my MC on them ready. Right. They've just jumped down now. So we're going to wait for them to start fighting people. And then we need to just watch them eating the soup. Right. They're fighting people now. 
So let's in of C. So I've explained this a thousand times, but just in case you don't know, this is their hotbar, and then all of these other slots are within their inventory. So if they're not hacking, they can only consume soup if it's on this top slot. But if we see soup disappear from within their inventory, that means they use an auto soup. At the minute, though, they just keep dying before we can watch them. Now, Kong really does not like cats, so I don't think he's gonna go easy on Neon if, uh, if they get caught. Hurry up and jump down! What are you doing? Stood in the corner. Oh, they've jumped down, they've jumped down. Right, now we just need to watch their in C. And... They've got anti-knockback. Are they using kill aura there? They're definitely using the anti-knockback. Let's check their inv C. Right, and soup is, as you can see, it's automatically being moved from wherever it is into this top slot and then just eaten instantly. Anti-knockback and auto soup. Let's find out how long we're burning him. Okay, hacker number three. I've moved them around once again. I feel like he's probably going to go for the one that he's right next to. So, in fact, let's do this so that they're just completely even. One week, one month, perm ban. Go on then, come on. <laughs> he thinks there's one in my hand. I mean, there is one in my hand, but... <laughs> oh! Go on, good boy! Oh, that's the perm ban! <laughs> I told you that Kong does not like cats, Neon Fat Cat. You are in trouble. <laughs> That's a big juicy perm man coming right up. <laughs> Bloody hell, Juice did not hold back on that ban reason. <laughs> Perfect. It's going well so far, isn't it? Just a bit of fun mixing things up. Let's keep going. Right, we're on factions right now, and Moth Boy is suspected of having X-Ray. As we TP to him, he's right at this minecart with chest. I see there is another one below that he might mine down to. I do have a base ready to paste in as well. So if he moves out of this mine shaft, we'll get the base pasted in. In the meantime, I'm going to just sit inside of him so we can see exactly what he sees. And if he gets a bit too up close and personal with a few walls, probably X-Ray. He's currently doing a lot of looking around, and he's just gone straight to this little chest, okay? There we are. This is the kind of thing I was talking about with uh, getting up close and personal. What are you looking at there? If you're not x-rayed, why are you looking so carefully at those four walls? What's this about? And same again there, right at the wall. <laughs> Away, moth boy, what are you playing at? <laughs> I'd want to get my base pasted down, but it'd be too obvious because he's not just heading in one specific direction. He's just gone to another one of these chests, though. He's heading down this way. Shall we take a risk and we'll paste the base? I'm going to paste a glorious base just down there. Look at that. That is a base and a half. I mean, I'd x-ray that. It is beautiful. <laughs> How close are you to that base, Moth boy. Moth boy, what a name. <laughs> Moth boy to the rescue. <laughs> Not gonna lie, Moth Boy, you are keeping me on my toes. I do not yet have any sufficient evidence to ban this guy. Right, our base that we pissed is just over there, and currently he's not too far away. If he's chest ASP and and has decent render distance, he should get to that fairly soon. Yeah, yeah, I think he spotted it. I think he spotted it. Mining up, mining up. He's getting ever so closer. He's looking at it. He is. He's heading over. He's running. He's really dabbling. He's teasing me. Why is he going up? He definitely made eye contact with it. He's just being really careful. While he's faffing on, we'll check his homes. Oh, he's he stood still at the minute. Could he potentially be free coming? Let's just wait for some random shifts. Yeah. Wait. Oh, no, no. Oh, he just disconnected. He got an anti-cheat notification and then disconnected. He either just lagged then or, yeah, he's come back on. He either just lagged or he was maybe trying to free cam or phase or something. I don't know. I mean, he's either not x-raying and I'm just wasting my time or he's just being really careful because he doesn't want to get banned. Let's check his homes because we got interrupted last time. Right, he's got a home here. Above. Hey, Tito Polly, thanks for purchasing Diamond Rag. He's got a home right here. And then his last home is called Walk and it's just in a random area and I don't see any bases other than the mineshaft below him. And he's, he's leaving the base. He's literally... Leaving the base. Free cam from a safe distance, maybe? Watch for some random shifts or anything. Come on! No, he's gone. He might have just set his home there. We're gonna have to go through all of his homes again. <laughs> I'm not giving up on you. No, last one is walk. He set his home. He did set his home. So he set his home as walk right here. And then our base is right there. He's being really careful. Moth boy, I am not giving up on you. I've got another base that we're going to paste down instead. And we'll just carefully watch his response. So he's currently heading this way. So I'm going to paste the base just there, just like that. It's a nice little vault, okay? So it's just down there. And is he looking at it? Is he making any eye contact with it? I'd, I'd be inclined to say that he is. No, maybe not actually. Wait, 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 wait. He just looked at it. He just looked... Yep, yeah, he's 100% x-ray and he's just being careful. That, that will right there. 
That was evidence. You cannot take that away from me. If we take him looking at the base, him setting his home right above this base, him standing too close to walls, and him going straight to minecarts with chest, he is 100% x ray -ing. Mothball, you did not make that easy on me, but I'm going to go ahead and undo both bases. I'm going to have a little dabble in your E chest. Ooh, TNT. Bunny boots. Cave spider spawners. Five of them. How did you manage to find all of them? Some god apples. Bedrock. Fortnightly bow. Actually, I may as well just take everything. Yeah, why not? You know, <laughs> this little fella looks like he could do with some goodies, so we're gonna just chuck everything over to him. There you go, mate. You enjoy. <laughs> Trench pickaxe, sure. There we are. That's everything. Lovely. Now, my plan wasn't to do much trolling because it's all about Kong this video, but this guy really got my mad up, so uh, just gonna do a little bit of this. <laughs> now, we're on OP factions, so it's gonna take a very long time to kill him, but it won't take quite as long as it took to catch him, will it? Let's keep going. There we go. Lovely. Juice to Crabs jumped in for the items. <laughs> Fair play, Juice. You earned it. <laughs> okay, finally. Let's go wake Kong up and find out how long we're banning that X-ray for. Right, Kong, what do you think with this X-ray? Once again, one week, one month, perm ban. I'm going to move Kong over there so he doesn't just go straight for this one. Kong, sit. Come on, then. Good boy. Oh, <laughs> good dog. That is a perm ban. Bloody hell, Kong, you good boy. Kong, my friend, you did not let me down. Mothboy put a rip in the chat, so I think he knows what's up. Juice stuck with us throughout that entire journey, so she can ban him. There we are. X-ray scum. <laughs> Okay, this is super fun. Should we see if we can find one last hacker? I think we might have just caught our last hacker of the video. Not Sanic might be using auto soups. Let's just watch, right? Are they PvPing at people at the moment? No, they're about to jump into a fight, though. Right, now we just need to watch for the soup to be gobbled. They are not taking enough damage. Oh, there we go, there we go. They're taking damage now. Right, wait for it, wait for it. So that was all fine, but if they start taking soup now, yeah, one soup just- There it is, there's auto soup. Every time they take some damage, soup is instantly being moved to this first slot and then eaten, so that's auto soup. <gasps> oh my goodness, wait! Juice says that he's he's a donator. Is this true? He is. He's got a he's got a green name tag. It's a hacking donator. He's and he's got the pufferfish suffix as well. What the bloody hell's going on? That is shocking. I kind of want to one v one him. One v one, not Sonic. Uh, we'll go with we'll go with Archer Kit Binary Arena. He's just said OMG in all caps. <laughs> Your request has been accepted. Here we go. <laughs> So he's put OMG, so he's obviously a fan of the channel, but why are you using auto soup? Alright, whatever. Let's uh let's see if we can take him down even though he's currently hacking. I'm assuming I'll have turned his hacks off. It was auto soup rather than like aimbot or anything. He says I turn my hacks off, so he knows what he's done. And oh we won. <laughs> That's a turn for the books. Let's find out how long we're banning him. I want to do something a bit mental for this final one, so I'm gonna say white cup is one day, purple cup is perm ban. So our standard ban for malicious hacks is 30 days. So to get a one day ban, that's pretty rare. We're setting Kong loose. Here he goes. Good boy. And that is a one day ban. Good boy. What are you doing, Kong? Why did you do that to me? The hacker just got away with a one day ban. Oh, Kong, why? Why one day, Kong? Everyone's gonna think that we've shortened his ban because he's a donator. Oh, dear me. <laughs> we're gonna ban him ourselves and we're gonna do a public ban across the entire network. One day. <laughs> Auto soup being donated. Scum brackets. Watch the vid to see why it's short. There he goes. <laughs> Thank you all very much for watching this. As you can see, Kong is pretty wiped out after all that. <laughs> but Kong, thanks so much for your help during this video. I had a lot of fun there. If you guys enjoyed watching this, then please do click that like button down below. And also, if this is the first video you've ever watched from me, because hopefully this video is going to get a million views as well, <laughs> then click that subscribe button, because we do hacker trolling videos like these every week. Also, come and check out the server, play.skykit.net. It is 100% not pay to win. Thank you to these awesome people that purchased ranks. The ranks give you access to a bunch of awesome cosmetic stuff. Thanks for watching. See you next time. <laughs>